If the coastline of the West Country is the defining marine environment, then it's the moorland that sums up the landscape. There are few signs of modern life here. It's a poetic and rather stark place, full of drama and mystery, but underneath it is a fragile ecosystem that, like many spots enjoyed by tourists, needs protecting. Bourbon Moors are obviously a very beautiful and special place. What is it that actually shapes the environment here? Well, I think it's defined really by the, um, it's by the rock, the granite. That's yeah. what defines Bourbon Moor. Yeah, what we're sitting yeah, on here. Yeah. yeah, it shapes everything. It shapes the landscape. It, it dictates the soil, which is very thin. It means that we're perched up here because it hasn't eroded away, so we get the roughest of the weather. It's, it's the most southerly area of western maritime heathland in the UK. Um, it means we've got special um, species of grasses and, and plants out there uh, that don't grow anywhere else because we've got the mild climate but the upland combined. Uh, and these obviously need to be protected. It looks really robust with all this granite, but mm. it, it's actually quite a fragile environment and it doesn't take much to tip the balance. Dominic farms Penquiet, an organic farm that's designed to let visitors understand what it's all about. And next to the farm's campsite is a solar-powered shower block. OK, so this is our um, campsite shower block. Uh, we built it as a... That Dominic is to, rather to proud of. Uh, it's all made of wood. We harvest all the rainwater off the, the hay barn and this roof. And there are a couple of solar panels on the roof that heat up the rainwater. This is all this recycled plastic, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, they're lined with recycled plastic made from bottle tops and, and yogurt pots. Okay. Dominic yeah. also has yes, some locally made yurts. So where do they originate from then? Well, they originate from Mongolia, uh, where they're still used by the nomads. They're really functional. I'm not sure how recognisable these ones would be to the Mongolians. Uh, there's, there's several <laughs> key differences. Felt, are they? No. Exactly. Um, <laughs> felt would be a disaster in our climate. Yeah. So ours are made from sal canvas. Can we go in? Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> Let's have a look. Oh, this is cute. It really is cute. It's camping in style, isn't it? Yeah. Everything you need, uh, except your sleeping bag. That's what I like to say. That's yeah. brilliant. Absolutely. And it's really yeah. peaceful and you just sit here with just the wind gently flapping on the canvas. 